For United Nations peacekeepers serving in South Sudan, the priority is to protect civilians and build durable peace in a country torn apart by violence. But all UN personnel also have a duty to ensure that their own behavior meets the high standards set by the United Nations and the Secretary General. That's why the UN mission in South Sudan is making it a priority to prevent and strongly respond to any cases of sexual exploitation and abuse by personnel. The head of the mission says there will be no second chance for any UN staff found guilty of committing such crimes. This call builds on the zero tolerance and no excuses stance taken by the Secretary General. The no second chance approach that we have in this mission is a feature that came out of a meeting with the SRSG, David Shearer. Essentially, we looked at the SG approach, which is generally zero tolerance and um, no excuse. And David Shearer then thought, actually, what we are really saying is that there is no second chance. Once you commit misconduct, then that's it. So in this mission, we have even further re-emphasized or strengthened the SG approach by having this added feature. The mission is carrying out training of all peacekeepers to ensure they know and uphold the highest standard of conduct. The campaign puts victims' rights at the center and focuses on strengthening investigations and reporting, as well as increasing transparency. We now have the requirement that every personnel will carry the No Excuses card, which has information on reporting misconduct. So we do plan to have this distributed. We currently have them being printed, but the idea is that every single personnel will also have this card, will know how to report allegations, and this card will emphasize their responsibility to report misconduct. The United Nations has also established a live misconduct database, which allows missions and UN headquarters in New York to share information on cases of misconduct concerning UN personnel. This reinforces the commitment right across the UN to prevent and respond strongly to any form of sexual exploitation and abuse.